Advent Health is opening a drive up site at the Seminole Town Center in Sanford. The County Health Department also opened a mobile testing site in Altamont Springs. And so far, both sites have been busy. News 6's Ezzy Castro has more on why health officials say it is so important to get people tested. The testing site here at the Seminole Town Center is located on the south side of the mall near Macy's and Avent Health workers say they have about 400 appointments set up for today. This is actually one of the two new testing sites opening up in Seminole County today. A busy morning for healthcare workers in Sanford at the drive up testing site at the Seminole Town Center. This is the third location operated by Avent Health. The other two sites are in Daytona Beach and Mala Millennia. Health workers tell us people with symptoms or who have been around a confirmed case of the coronavirus are allowed to get tested here. I know we had a hot spot early on uh, in the Oviedo area um, where we were seeing a handful of uh, patients in the first months of the outbreak in, uh, our, at our Oviedo Centric Care. So I anticipate uh, Seminole will probably still have a, you know, that 2% rate. While that site is available, Seminole County health officials are launching mobile testing today. The first location opened up here at the Apostolic Church Jesus Christ in Altamont Springs this morning. Uh, this is our first pop-up test site. We'll be doing this in seven different communities around Seminole County and it's to help uh, the lower income, those that may have problems with transportation. We've already had some walk-ups uh, today. Officials say they'll move the pop-up testing to a different location every day for the next week so Seminole County residents can get tested for free. We're able to reach out to communities that we know may have difficulties coming in and get tested. Um, because we've seen evidence of community spread uh, is the reason why we've opened it up to asymptomatic residents. And we have a full list of those pop-up sites here in Seminole County on quickorlando.com. As for this site, this will stay open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. In Seminole County, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.